Thinking back to the EC2 15 year anniversary, that does go back a long ways. It's about 2005, a year before S3 was announced. And I was working on a technical due diligence acquisition project at the company I was working with at the time. In this 2005 example, the company under review was a cloud hosted service. We decided to go ahead with the acquisition. It became a wholly owned subsidiary and I was asked to be general manager. A bit less than a year after that, S3 was announced and the pricing seemed flat crazy. Uh, I've worked in database and storage all my life and I think I know what's possible and that simply wasn't. 15 cents per gigabyte per month was instantly game changing and there are now over 100 trillion objects stored in S3. Around that same time, I wrote a fairly good-sized S3 application. I was going to be demoing to the CEO and the CTO of the company where I was working at the time. Consequently, I tested it fairly heavily, invested a lot of time in it, and over the course of the month, my AWS bill came in at $3.08. I didn't even bother to file an expense claim. I left all the data in place, and the next month I was billed a further three cents. That experience really drove home the point that cloud-hosted services were changing the world. I couldn't even figure out how it was even conceivable to be able to cost-effectively build numbers that small. It's hard to say with certainty what the next 15 years will bring, but when I look forward, I expect to see a continued emergence of specialized computing. We'll see increased hardware specialization with an ever wider variety of EC2 instance types. The cloud takes away the utilization problems that come from a single customer trying to buy hardware tailored to a single narrow workload. In the cloud, at high scale, there are always thousands, potentially even tens of thousands of even very niche workloads. EC2 already has more than 400 instance types across 67 instance families, and that's just gonna keep going. From that first AWS customer meeting I attended 15 years ago, what surprised me more than anything has been the customer innovation opened up by EC2 and the totality of the AWS platform. It's been a pretty exciting 15 years, and it feels like the pace is still quickening.